let's see if we can get FTP server up. Uh, Backtrack comes with uh, pure FTPD installed by default. Let's see if we can get it up and running. All right, so okay, let's run over the steps to get FTP working again. It didn't quite work last time, but I got it fixed. So let's try to do the same thing, but with a different user. So we'll go through the steps one more time. Okay, group add FTP group. Now, when I put in this command, it'll say that there's already that group. So that's okay. I just wanted to go through the commands once again. All right, so okay, that group already exists. No problem. Okay, user add dash G FTP group dash D and dev null dash s forward slash etc ftp user right and that was the second command and we've already got um, user ftp user so those two commands are fine um, we're gonna now we'll need a new command so pure dash pw user add and we'll add a new user and we'll call this user Joe. Okay, so user add Joe dash u FTP user. Okay, it's going to be an FTP user and dash D, his home directory will be home FTP. Let's see here pub and then his username Joe all right we'll do that and we'll give him a password and we'll give him the password I'll put in a test password here um, okay all right I entered it twice for Joe for this test user all right, now I'm going to do a pure pwmkdb. All right, for the database. All right, that looks good. Then I'm going to, and this is what was missed, I'm going to change directory into the etc directory. Pure dash ftpd auth. All right, so I'm in there. And then I'm going to create a link up one directory to the comp file pure db 60 pdb. All right. Now I'll need to make some directories. So mkdir. I have to make sure I've already made the FTP directory and the pub directory, but I'm going to have to make a directory for home FTP pub Joe. All right, that looks good. Then I will Chone capital R dash capital R FTP user FTP group and then the path to that directory home FTP pub Joe. All right. Okay, that looks good. All right. Now, all I have to do is restart the FTP server and see if I can log in. So I will etsy init.d pure FTPD restart. All right, we restarted the server.
and now I will try to log in. All right, I'm going to put the username Joe and then the password. All right, and it's okay, I'm in. So now I'm inside. I can look at the files and I'll just put in the command by and I'm out. So it looks like the FTP server is working. I can run a netstat command dash antp for TCP protocol. And you can see here that port 21, let's see here, listening on port 21, there it is. All right. Okay, it looks like we're listening. There's pure FTPD right here, listening on port 21. TCP port 21, pure FTPD, and it looks like we have the active server. So what if I want to do, if I want to turn it off, I can just stop it right here.